welcome to today's film diary. It's the uh, 27th, yep, 27th of September today. Uh, so that's about a week, roughly a week since the last diary. Um, so what's happened? Well, again, we've had another um, bout of wind and rain in the last couple of days. Um, Obviously, just temporary measure the uh, the butterflies over, and I think we've got an another storm coming over in the next couple of days, which is Agnes. I think is arriving. It's arriving on uh, west coast Ireland today, and then we'll pass over the rest of the UK in the next day or so. So we've got more more to come. Uh, it's kind of inevitable that uh, I'm going to be here filming when it's wet over the next couple of months. I have to look at uh, wet weather gear and protection for, uh, for the equipment. Today is building day. Yes, you've heard it correct. This is building day. This is when the classroom arrives. So nothing else doesn't appear to be any other further damage since the previous um, wind, wind and rain from the from the from a couple of weeks ago. So nothing's been fixed or repaired yet and nothing's been damaged further we have lost one of the trees it looks like a fresh one uh deer right, it's over there we'll go and have a look it's somewhere over there um it looks quite fresh uh it's died very quickly the uh, it's the the marchant whether it's a pear or an apple not sure i need to check with andrew but it's um one of those saplings it's been eaten by deer or the bark's been eaten by deer so it's uh, it's not lasted so there we go this is this is the base that you've seen but here you can see all the, uh, the framework has arrived or the first part of it the, uh, the builders have just gone off to get some, some wood there so lots lots of stuff to go on and the builders are off to go and get some roof bits I think I said roof panels so they couldn't bring it all at once so they're off to go and get that and they'll be back in about 45 minutes or so which I thought was a perfect idea just to do today's diary so there's not much really I've had a quick scout around and there's not really much changing this sort of, they've marked out the They've marked out the um, butterfly H or E, sorry, butterfly E, because it's E shaped. Um, and you can have a look at our interview with Andrew and he explains more about what it is and the purpose of it and why it's an E shape. And so this is what we've got. We've got the, so you can just make out, just clear this up, just make out, it's, it's kind of E shaped. We've got these these poles have gone in for um, I know maybe new saplings uh, hold it together. It's got to be uh, they've got to seed it and put plants in it as well. So everything that uh, a butterfly needs. I don't know if there's been any recent scything. I mean, it looks it's a mixture. So you've got uh, strimming. So what they're doing is they're strimming, like this bit here is strimmed. So you've got this sort of section here, or that bit there is strimmed. And then the rest of that through the trees and that is all sized as, uh, as much as possible. 